Hello guys, welcome back. Dito tayo sa AdWords and what we are going to do today is we will add more keywords. So sa pag-login sa AdWords, minsan may symbol na nakalagay dito sa notifications. And once I click on that notifications, meron siyang mga suggestions, additional keywords na pwede nating idagdag. So 7, 7, tsaka 9. Yung unahin natin dito sa AdWords keywords is yung mas marami ang weekly clicks, yung mas marami ang weekly impression. So, uh, you can see here on the opportunities tab, ano yung mga suggestions ng AdWords. And then, i before mo i-approve yan, i-review mo muna. So, how do we do that? Dito sa opportunities tab, uh, you see here three opportunities. We, we will start with the one with the most weekly clicks and the one with the most weekly impressions. So click on view. And it will now show us ano yung mga keywords na ginasuggest nitong Google AdWords. So these are automatic suggestions from Google and we will just choose ano yung sa tingin natin are, um, are related. Okay. So I don't I don't think the for sale by owner Fort Worth is always going to be real estate. It can be other things for sale. So let's remove that. And condos, I'm not exactly sure if the client is using condos kasi mostly purus bahay yung na observe ko doon sa mga binenta niya. Let's remove that for now. Lots for sale, they did mention na lots. And mansions for sale, it would be good. However, yun, I haven't seen any anything from their website, pati yung sa mga nabenta niya before na mansion. So I'll remove that as well. And condos, yeah, let's remove that. Duplex, pwede pa siguro. Uh, farms for sale possibly kasi lot for sale farms for sale properties for sale okay and mostly dito sa right side makita natin yung uh, ano yung keyword na pinakamaraming searches every week so at least itong itong first keyword na gi-check natin ito yung um, ito yung pinakamarami so that's a good that's a good thing and once we are done, click on apply. Ayan. So, let's review this second set of keywords with 5 weekly clicks and 30 weekly impressions. Click on view. At home, Fort Worth. So, parang hindi siya related. Possible na hindi siya buy and sell ng bahay. So, Fort Worth Homes million dollar homes in Fort Worth, Texas, why not? Okay, so Fort Worth luxury homes, pwede pa. New homes, new build homes in Fort Worth, okay. Historic Fort Worth homes, parang hindi siya masyado related. You know, it's not likely. Uh, it's possible na yung nag-search nitong historic Fort Worth homes are not looking for buying a real estate. They are possibly, you know, looking for saan yung pupuntahan nila kasi siguro mga historian, mga antique collectors or travelers who just want to visit yung mga old houses and learn about the history. So, hey, those are just my thoughts. I may be wrong, I may be right, I'll never know. So, it's it's really up to you to make those uh, tiny decisions. And looking at the right side, Ang pinaka maraming weekly searches is yung Fort Worth Homes and it's part of the uh, keywords that we chose which is a good sign. And click apply. And lastly, um, itong weekly clicks, tsaka weekly impressions na plus 1 lang, tsaka plus 12, sige lang. Uh, Dallas, Fort Worth, hindi siya, actually nandyan din ang Fort Worth, but they do not sell in Dallas, but since andyan yung Fort Worth, sige lang, let's add that. 
new homes for sale homes for sale homes for sale TCU okay okay lang yan basta may Fort Worth luxury homes Fort Worth homes for sale with pool eh why not Fort Worth homes for sale 76109 ito yung zip code as long as nandyan yung Fort Worth that's good um, so we'll hit apply and that's basically it so that's it for this video and we did some maintenance over the past few days and I showed you uh, ano yung mga ginawa and ito yung up and down movement kung ilan ang nag click in the last um, the last few days so this this is normal we see a decline pagdating ng Friday tsaka Saturday kasi I'm guessing Friday is the time na people are tired from work and you know they Saturday is the time na nag rest ang tao and then Sunday may konting energy na sila mag ano na naman so we'll see we'll see if this pattern is consistent in this particular industry na wala masyado sa Friday and Saturday and hindi pa tapos yung Monday so we are still waiting for more data so that's basically it um, just keep tracking i-choose mo itong dito sa taas na na date range pwede mo gawing all time or last 30 days or last month in this case I chose all time and then you want to check back on the ads and extensions tapos yung extensions kasi makita natin dito na dumadami ba yung nagatawag through this call extension kasi ito yung for this particular client ito yung one of the most important results that they are looking for that someone will call their cell phone or their landline number and so there are nine calls in just the last couple of days and the expense is so far very low pa so that's a good sign they already received nine na tawag doon sa phone with a small cost of nine dollars and so and then marami na rin nakabisita sa website okay so, 9 calls out of the 25. So, ang nagbisita sa website, mga 16. 25 minus 9. So, that's 16 people who visited their website. And, you know, they possibly contacted them through the email. And, so, that's basically it for this video. So, see you in the next video.